you know, he's he's really surging. Seemed like he had it dialed, and unfortunately, that wall tap takes him out. And now we have an all RTR battle. James Dean already in it. He is uh, just up there in the top. So whoever wins this battle could potentially go against James Dean in the four, pending on advancement. Who moves on right now? Adam LZ, Chelsea Denofa. Adam LZ will lead. He qualified 11th. Chelsea Denofa qualifying 27th. All RTR, ready to rock. Here comes Adam LZ for the Mustang RTR. Spec 5FD, both these guys on Nitto tires. Big initiation from Adam LZ. Chelsea Denofa dropping into formation. Now to that side. Oh, we got rubber on rubber. Nitto on Nitto crime. And Chelsea Denofa looks like maybe too aggressive. Maybe taking himself out. Go past that inside clip. Now pass and into that final outside zone. Ryan, a big disruption of that Pennzoil Mustang of Chelsea Denofa. Let's run it back and take another gander. Yeah, he certainly uh, got a bit over aggressive there against LZ, but you, you got to give it up to, to the driver of Chelsea Denofa. I mean, that was an incredible save. Huge angle in the chase position. Chasing down Adam LZ, who's been really good this event. LZ falls out of that outside zone. Denofa makes that adjustment, is right back in proximity here. Good transition back around by both drivers. Here comes Denofa again, and LZ just on the inside and then moving to the deeper part of that zone towards the latter part of the run. And now we will see things switched up. You can see a lot of drivers would make that contact and unwind it to the point where the mistake would be so big to overcome. Denofa just has that ability to be able to manipulate the car in such a way that even a mistake or an over aggressiveness, he can save it and still make it look good. And in the eyes of the judges, I think that that's gonna bode well, but it's only half of the battle that needs to be done now. Now we gotta switch it up, go to the lead, and LZ is gonna have to keep the pressure on. You know, Chelsea has a lot more seat time behind the wheel of the Ford Mustang as he's been with the RTR team a little bit longer, but Adam, you know, here at this event, don't know if it's the Sally's of Pete's or what it is, but seems that he is hitting his stride here in New Jersey. Remember, he's running a split season. Adam LZ, the RTR Mustang, the all-new 2024. Again, the, uh, the Spec 3 being debuted for the streetcar. Shout out to Von Gitt Jr. I know he's watching at home. Here we go. Chelsea Denofa will lead Adam LZ giving chase. I'm expecting a big initiation here from Chelsea Denofa. And there it is. Gets all of the course. Adam LZ, straight line approach. Here comes Adam and Chelsea in that second outside zone. You can see filling all of it. Adam LZ trying to bang on the door. Whoa, oh. gets, gets out, exceeds the track line. And now to that final outside zone. Oh my gosh. Wow, so look at that. I mean, losing back bumpers. I know Chelsea is bumper budgets out the window and out the doors, but uh, let's take an overhead view. Adam LZ, how far did he exceed on that second outside zone in the chase? I mean, what stood out to me there was the just the precision and location of Denova in outside zone one. I mean, right in and locked in, but he gets into outside zone two a little bit late, a little bit shallow, makes that adjustment. Here comes LZ, but as you said, Jared, he drops those wheels off the course, loses a little bit of ground to Denofa. Now on this final turn here, he starts surging back ahead, but Denofa clears the finish line. And, and once again, we see that really good car control from Denofa out front and outside zone one. Had he been able to do that in outside zone two, I think it's kind of a no-brainer. But then we see LZ make a little bit of a mistake by pushing too hard, going wide at the end of outside zone two, and giving a little bit back to Chelsea Denofa. You know, we, we didn't know what to expect here, the RTR battle between Denofa and LZ. Adam LZ, you know, not gunning for a championship because obviously, you know, with him, only running four rounds. He is down there in 31st. Chelsea Denofa second in points. So you, you got to think, you know, no no team orders here. You want to win. You want to win right. But uh, which way is he going to go? Left for Adam LZ or right for Chelsea Denofa? Oh, Adam wow. LZ gets the victory. So one more time. So it looks like Brian Eggert and Robin Ishida side with Adam LZ. And Chelsea Denofa is knocked out. Wow. So... Yeah, let's. We need an explanation on yeah, that. Yeah, we one. got we got to get an explanation on that. Brian Eggert, uh, want to make sure. Brian, how we doing, bud? Nope. 
How about now? So, uh, yeah, there you go, Brian. So, uh, Adam LZ, what happened? Uh, he did a, a great lead, uh, did really well. Um, going through it, like, and then we had Chelsea here, uh, as you can see. Uh, Chelsea got right to the edge on his lead as well. Uh, then you have Adam in the chase here. Chelsea didn't get out to outer zone two as well as Adam did in his lead. Adam does drop a tire here at the end of outer zone two, but he's able to catch up here, and he does well following the rest of the run. So really his only big mistake was there. Um, Chelsea's big thing in his lead was just not really filling outer zone two as much as Adam did. And uh, based on that, when you watch Adam's run here as well, uh, Adam did great in outer zone one, comes into outer zone two, fills it a little bit deeper, does a great job all the way throughout. So I, I feel like out of the two leads, Adam had the better lead. And then when it came down to the mistakes on a second run, they were pretty much fairly similar. But I think that lead is what kind of did it for Adam and gave him that win for us. Would you say that the tire drop, it, while the smoke looks significant and things like that, it, the, the, the degree to which that's a mistake uh, is, is neutralized by some of the things that Chelsea didn't do? Uh, possibly, and I think it's where not one might cross out the other one, but it might not be enough to offset. Basically, if you compare the leads uh, and then you compare the chases, I mean, Chelsea's chase was still really good as well, but I think that just the lead that Adam gave him the chase was just a little bit better, and it's kind of like if you got to pick between the two, got to have a good lead to have the good chase, and Adam gave him that opportunity. Gotcha. Some great insight there from Brian Eggert. And that concludes our Royal Purple Top 16. We have our Torque Motorsports Great 8, Torque Drift 2.